This is the time you've all been waiting for. This ain't humdrum, this is tough drum. Thanks, George, as we give you a day in the life of Molly Lockup Meldrum. You're a private dancer, dancing Guy, for money, <laughs> dancing whatever you do. <laughs> all right. Well, listen, now, for those in the know, and from Victoria, because uh, we do a radio show down here, and we, of course, locked ourselves, Gavin and I, in the studios for about 26... Uh, in fact, Gavin was in there for 27 hours, and I was in there for 26 hours, uh, and it was all over Tina Turner and Actors' Equity. We'd like to thank everyone, the support we got uh, from the Victorians, because it was wonderful, and all those people interstate who sent telegrams, etc. Thanks very much. Are you uh, still awake, Gavin, eh? Oh, no, he's going to sleep. What a fool he is, too. It's a dreadful dancer, too. He'll do anything to get on camera. All right, now, listen, uh, on the home front, the party boys uh, are on the road again, and this time they've got a great lineup. Mark Hunter is going to be the lead singer this time around, and Joe Walsh from America, great Joe Walsh. Uh, he's in the band, and also, of course, Kevin Burrows and Paul Christie. And it just should be a fantastic trip. Are you going to one of the concerts, Gavin? I'll be there. Oh, so will I. It'll be really good stuff. They pass by you, don't miss them. And Deep Purple, anyone here like Deep Purple? No? Hey! Deep Purple um, uh, are touring and, of course, December 9th and 10th at uh, Festival Hall in Brisbane, Sydney Entertainment Centre, 12th, 13th and 14th, and Melbourne Entertainment Centre, 16th, 17th and 18th. And uh, that's of, of December. All right, let's uh, whip over to the US and have a look at the top five. All right, here we go. At number five, Tina Turner. There she is. Go, Tina. Better be good to me. Saw her last week in concert in Sydney. Fantastic. Oh, absolutely. Brilliant. Prince. Anything here like Prince? Yes. Purple Rain at number four. Chaka Khan, great song, I Feel For You. It's your favourite song, Gavin, isn't it? No, I love this one. Yes, number three. Oh, at number two, Hall & Oates, the brilliant guys from New York with Out Of Touch, great song. Heading for the number one spot. At number one, Wham! Wake me up before you go, go. going on uh, with, with Gavin and I, wasn't there, Gav? Yes, wakey, um, wakey. And uh, George looks pretty good in that film clip. And incidentally, I shouldn't be saying this, but we think we've got an exclusive copy of Freedom. So watch out for that on camp and hopefully next week. All right, I'll tell you what, uh, talking about uh, trips, I'm going, in fact, uh, this weekend, I sort of, it's really strange because I'm still sitting here, but would you believe on Saturday night, uh, I will be going to Los Angeles to see the last uh, Jackson uh, concert uh, with Michael and, and Jermaine and the boys. And then I fly to Toronto on Sunday and in fact I'll be seeing Prince in concert. And then on Monday I'm catching up with a favourite lady of mine, uh, Madonna. Anyone here like Madonna? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, talking, uh, ooh, ooh. talking about friends, uh, Rod Stewart, uh, would you believe, uh, is touring the country in January and I hope I don't yawn through these dates. Uh, nothing against you, Rod. Sydney Entertainment Centre, January 29th and 30th. Melbourne Sports and Ed uh, Entertainment Centre, February 5th and 6th. Adelaide, this is the hardest card you can ever read. Memorial Drive, February the 12th. And Perth Entertainment Centre, February 15th. And I certainly hope that Rod is in a better mood than he was than he was in Washington. In fact, he uh, was quite a, um, you could say, a pain in the, in, the, in, the, in the backside at that stage. UK top five for this week. Mm -hmm, I'm in a lot of trouble now. At number five, Lamal. He's back on the charts. Never end ending story at number five. Oh, good song. Number four, great songwriter, good singer. Nick Kershaw with the riddle. At number three, Frankie Goes to Hollywood, Power of Love. Go Holly. At number two, it's working everywhere, this song. Chuck a Khan with I Feel For You. And at number one, Jim Diamond, I Should Have Known Better, my theme song. And I'll tell you what, it took me a couple of listens, but I really like that song now. All right, I'll tell you what, uh, back in the studio, we have a group now in Centre Stage, and uh, I've admired this group for a long, 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 long time. Uh, they've had their ups and downs, they've, uh, uh, they've had line-up changes, but uh, they're back together again, and they're back together in fine style. I've heard nothing but rave reviews for their live concerts, and I can imagine that, and especially with this track, which is quite sensational. And I'm talking about the models, and they're uh, the hit on the charts at the moment, and this is, it's, it's quite sensational. Uh, well, in fact, I think it's the best thing they've done. Bing on love. Bing. Oh, oh models. 